Good afternoon, this is 4046. Well, I do apologise for the lack of content recently. Uh, unfortunately, being back at work has taken up an exceptional amount of time and I forgot how much time it takes up of my day. So I do once again apologise. As an update to the last video, it's looking very much like London Irish will be no more. Um, which I find rather sad. It's probably the fact that it had such a massive amount of debt that, debt that it wasn't attractive to a potential buyer. I do apologise because since the last video, uh, keeping his glasses clean is uh, a full time job, <laughs> it would seem. Today, I'd like to talk about something that I have experienced, which is quite interesting really, being in the right place at the right time, or sometimes the wrong place at the, uh, at the wrong time. In, in my short existence on this blue and green ball, I have been hit by a bus, but miraculously survived. Um, all I got was a scrape on one side of my arm and it broke the belt I was wearing so more like a glancing hit but it was still nonetheless hit by a bus I do feel sorry for the driver because it wasn't his fault um, in this country we have bus lanes and there was a particular instance where I should have been a bit more observant and at the time I wasn't so I got a glancing hit by this bus and was chucked about 20 to 30 feet down the road. Um, I survived though, but I got off that quite lightly because I could actually walk away from it, but um, I do feel sorry for the bus driver because um, he, he was not in great shape uh, for that. And I would like to think that they gave him some form of support of taking him in and off uh, when he got back to the depot. I'm sure all of you have had amazing instances that have happened in your lives. Another such instance was a late night on a pebble beach and someone we knew put their car keys down on the pebble beach and walked away. Now if, if you know anything about pebble beaches, especially large pebble beaches, it's very difficult to find something like that especially in the hours of darkness um, it, it just you can't really put a figure on it should have played the lottery that night as well but I did not however after having arrived there probably about 1 or 2 a.m. just to watch the sea and having then this lady having locked herself out the car and then trying to figure out ways in um, to the car which unfortunately was a very well built car and if you're not a professional burglar then very difficult to try and get in however it got to about four or five o'clock in the morning the light was started the sun was coming out up I was walking across the beach and in the area where she'd done drop the keys and then it was really bizarre I felt just felt odd under my foot even though this is a pebble beach so it's going to feel odd anyway anyway I lifted my foot up and there were the keys <laughs> there were the keys underneath my foot I should really have uh, placed a bet or something on the lottery that day absolutely amazing I mean the odds I wouldn't even want to begin to work out the odds extremely surprising to be fair and another time I was in my friend's loft helping him helping him insulate the loft and through some clumsiness I hasten to add I fell down the stairs in a uh, step ladder 
and I've got a teeny tiny bit of friction burn from obviously going down the stairs but I came out of it okay I mean that could have so badly gone wrong but it didn't and I'm quite thankful that it didn't I, I do believe that um, they thought I was going to sue or something like that but I'm, I'm not I'm not that way orientated never have been I never will be I don't think I'm sure you've had many many experiences in your life over however many years it is you've been around as we're roughly coming to a halfway point in the video I would like to thank all my subscribers and the extra subscriber I've gained I really would like to reach 25 subscribers in the next month or so that would mean a great deal to me for those of you that already have subscribed thank you very much and I do appreciate the amount of views I had on my last video um, that's the most views I've ever had on one of my videos to date so very very grateful for that um, but I would like you to please like and subscribe for those of you that already are I do appreciate you you watching my videos I will make them on a variety of different subjects it's not just the same thing within the next couple of months hopefully be able to get a new laptop and uh, be able to make better quality content at the moment I do everything in one take as you can no doubt tell I suspect and there's one last thing I'd like to talk about in this video um, it's about mental health again. I know I have had specific videos about mental health. However, one by well, my nearest and dearest um, confessed to having self-harmed, and you you realise how high it, it must have been great difficulty for them to admit to this, but they did. And they're sort of relieved, sad, because obviously they were doing, they felt they needed to do that. But relieved because it wasn't a case where this had been going on for six months or longer. It had only been going on for a few months. Uh, we had asked her if she, point blank if she was, and then um, admitted to her mum that she had been doing that with any of you that are, uh, my viewers that have no doubt had to deal with this it's difficult there's no easy way forward I will be sorting out some counselling for her because luckily enough for whom I work um, not only is counselling available to me but to my family as well so I'll be taking steps to do that she's I do talk well just speaking to her a bit more than I have been even though I spoke was speaking to her a lot anyway um, but it's not an easy thing to sort out some of you may not have anything um, for counselling but some of the ways looking forward with it are for example having an elastic band on your wrist or their wrist should I say and then every time you think about that you ping it and um, a, a tight elastic band on your arm pinged is not not the nicest of sensations um, well, most of you can be sure of that another such technique which was told to by somebody close to me was um, to get ice cubes and put them in your hand and let them melt but the, the pain from the ice cube should put you off of actually cutting yourself um, there there is there is a few different ways another way is writing a journal every time you have such thoughts but ultimately you don't want to have such thoughts so you need more help counseling is the way forward I know I'm quite a pro can, um, advocate for counseling but I can't be more sincere 
to then say that cancelling is the way forward. It's it, just because you might not get the right one the first time doesn't mean the second or even third time that you will you will get there's there's a cancer there out there for any, any everybody. It's just finding the right one. And every cancer is different in how they approach said subject. I mean, I'm just glad that I found out about it before, you know, it um, involved having to go to the hospital or something like that, which um, would have been terrible. I mean, it's not just terrible for myself and the family, but it's, it's even worse for her because instead of dealing with it in a healthy way, he's dealt it with it in a very destructive way. She was afraid that all of us were going to have a go at her, but far be it, we're, we're not that sort of family. We would not, we would not do that in any way, shape, or form. Plus, also, I will be trying to sort of come up with two to three videos a week. Unfortunately, in this particular time, because it's just been nothing but work, 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 I have been doing so much work in the last two weeks that um, sadly it's come to a little bit of a standstill. I think the next video I will probably do is probably going to be possibly about birds as I find them interesting. We have many different species in this country. I would like at a later date to do some deep dive videos as I promised for example, Babylon 5. I know there are many channels, YouTube channels out there. There's a resurgence at the moment because there's a new film, uh, even though it is animated, coming out in the next few months or so. so but it's already been finished. I think it's in post-production um, or it's in the can and just ready to go. But um, yes, I've, I've not gone. 4046 is still very much here. Uh, give a big shout out to um, those, those that um, have been kind enough to comment on my videos and have subscribed to my videos. But if you like what you see, I will continue to grow my content and it will improve in quality and it will also improve in a different variety of subjects that I wish to cover at a later date when I'm got a bit more content then I will start to try and do videos with guests and uh, record sessions in which we talk about for example the 80s or the 90s as we were growing up in those times and then maybe focusing on a particular year of that decade or an event or something that may have happened be it personal or worldwide or nationwide at the time I do thank you very much for your time and taking to watch this video I know it's not been the best of videos because it's been a kind of jumble of things but um, I wanted to provide you with something at least uh, whilst I try to formulate a more uh, better schedule uh, next week I'm off an entire week so I would like to produce maybe a video a day that would be that would be good quite a feat in itself as well because my videos are getting longer these days but um, I'd like to make some great content for you and I thank you for taking your time to watch this and I do appreciate your support your likes and please subscribe I really really mean that please please subscribe the amount of subscribers I've already got has given me the impetus to carry on. I, I want all you guys to have at least a, some of my content that is relevant to you. And it would be very much um, appreciated to get a, a bigger viewer base, shall we say. Anyway, thank you for watching. This is 4046. And see you in the next.